Hello everyone, Ali Reza from Noble Rom Support here and in today's video I'm going to show you some new features in One UI 4.1 and Android 12. As you can see I have Noble Rom version 2.1 installed so now let's get things started. Uh, first thing I want to show you is that the color palette has been improved and the color accuracy and color choices in, is now way better compared to One UI. 4.0 um, the other thing is in widgets menu we have a new option called smart widgets as you can see when i add smart widgets here i have the option to have a few widgets just in one place by sliding to left or right as you can see in here when I just hold it and tap on the settings, I have the uh, option to add some other widgets in here as well. The other option is when you go to the gallery. And uh, actually, um, the thing I want to show you is a new feature called uh, Add Portrait Effect to the Photo. It actually needs a face to be detected on the photo, otherwise it won't work. Um, as you can see, uh, the AI just recognized my face and added bokeh effect to the photo. Uh, the other options we have, which is not new, uh, is the object eraser. But the thing new in, in this section is the labs option. Uh, labs option actually improves the overall um, um, re object remover. Um, by the options we have in here like shutter eraser or reflection eraser in here um, The other thing I want to show you is now inside the advanced settings a span menu and a Menu style you can now have the standard uh, air action menu or just the compact mode which is similar uh, to the Android 11. It's a good feature to have so people can choose uh, depending on what they like more. Uh, the other option is uh, <coughs> when you go back and you have the smart suggestion uh, for the smart keyboard, smart widgets, calendar reminder and messages which is again cool and uh, the other options we have is in lab sections now we do have the full screen in split screen view okay let me show you how this works uh, when i actually open a split screen view you see that the gesture pin and also a status bar is hidden so it gives a better overall experience for multitasker uh, multitaskers uh, the other actually option we have is inside the accessibility menu, hearing enhancements, and now you have the option to balance left and right sound for both um, headphones and phones speakers, which was only one option in the previous One UI 4 versions. Okay, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and peace out.